Here's how your hair will actually turn heads in public with this banana bushel bubble braid. So fun. If you want a real challenge, then this is for you. You're gonna be weaving a lot of hair. So pretty. I think this one is so fun. I get so many compliments on it. Welcome back to another episode of Braiding School 101 with Kenna. This might be the most difficult tutorial. It actually took me a little bit to learn it, and it was a little bit frustrating. Definitely easier to do on someone else. I'm going to use some styling cream for this because I do have some dirty hair. Really, really good brush. A little bit of hair oil. This is the Mad Hair Co. hair oil. You're gonna be putting your hair in like five different ponytails. Doing the very top one. You are gonna want your clear hair elastics. You're gonna flip that guy over. You're gonna keep going. You're just gonna do four instead of five. Your four ponytails. I'm gonna look like this. Give your arms a little break because... Also make sure you eat a snack before because my tummy is grumbling. A little bit of styling cream. This is gonna be the trickiest part to master. You're weaving strands back and forth between each section. That top strand. And you're going to take out a small little section from the left. And then while you're holding that, you're gonna bring up your second... Grab the second ponytail. Take a strand from your second ponytail and bring it up between that section. And then I just, I bring it forward and put it in my mouth. You're gonna do the same thing. So once you've woven all of those together, I know it's kind of confusing. I hope that made sense. I'm going to attach these pieces to the third ponytail. Now you can bring these pieces back like this. So now you have the start of your banana bushel braid. You're going to take these pieces and weave them through this section. So now you already have these pieces that are already separated. You're going to take this piece Wrap it around, grab a piece from this section, bring it up. I'm gonna take a break between each section, man. Oof. You're gonna attach these ones. Same thing with this last part here. I'm actually gonna go through and pull out these strands and poof them out before I finish the whole braid. Little tart palette mirror. Once you've pulled out a good amount of the sections, you're just gonna go through. I usually pull mine forward, grab from the bottom, pull it through, pull through, voila. Okay, now it looks a little wonky from here, but of that bushel braid look, just gonna add a little elastic here at the end. And there you have a banana bushel bubble braid and some pretty shredded arms and shoulders after that. <laughs> Let me know if you guys want to see more hair tutorials because I definitely have more. Follow along with me for braiding school 101. Love you guys.